Is changing classes in Diablo Immortal worth it? Well, let's talk about it. So I just recently changed from a necromancer to a demon hunter. And I don't want to waste y'all time too much. Y'all know where to go. You come right here in West March and it's self-explanatory. It tells you how to do it. Um, I just wanted to kind of talk about is it worth it? Uh, and the first thing you need to think about is are you a casual player? As in, do you like to hop on, maybe do your bounties, run a few dungeons, and you know, then you get off? Or are you a more hardcore player and you care about, you know, the, the paragon level, you care about keeping up with it and uh really grinding hard for your character to have all the best gear, uh, and all the best stuff. So you have to think about which one you are. Um really my opinion so if you're a hardcore player and you really want to get into this game and get all of the best stuff i would recommend changing classes because overworld grinding for legendaries does get boring kind of old you know so changing classes gives you a fresh experience um and also learning all of the new abilities your your new character has and there's just so much to explore within changing classes so I would I would say definitely if you if you want to grind heavy and you're bored with the class you started off with, yeah maybe go ahead and change classes it'll it'll be a fresh experience. Um, now if you are a more casual player, I would probably just recommend just making a new character. Okay, so listen, so so you get on every day, you do your bounties, maybe run a few dungeons, play for maybe an hour or so, and that's it. Okay, well then starting a new character. Just to enjoy a new experience, that's not a big deal. You know, you're not really taken away uh, from the game. It's actually, if that's how you want to play the game, that's a fun way to play. Um, nothing wrong with it. Now, and I'll also say, if you're more casual and you don't like the grind of it, um, as you can see, I did a class change yesterday. I only have one legendary piece, okay, or maybe two. I got one legendary piece, so I only have one ability for my uh, legend ability for my new character, my new class. I'm sorry. So, if you don't want to spend, we're talking five to ten hours a day. Uh, let's be more realistic: three to eight hours a day grinding. Then you're gonna be changing classes, and you're gonna be at a huge disadvantage simply because you won't have all of your abilities uh, for your legendary. So. If you're a more casual player and you only get on, like I said, you, you spend under an hour a day, I wouldn't recommend it. Uh, I would definitely just make a new class. Uh, now, if you're a hardcore player, like I mentioned earlier, um, it adds a whole new experience to the game. So that's one thing to keep in mind when changing classes. At the end of the day, it's really just how you want to play the game. If, if And a big part of it is if you like the grind of the game, that's a very big um thing too so i mean i'd probably think about it before doing it just you know if you're watching this video you probably are thinking about changing classes i hope this video helps y'all because uh you really have to put a lot of time into this game if you know if you want to be if you want to keep up with all the other players so i guess it's just how you look at it if you're a hardcore player and you, you're kind of bored you want something new go ahead and change classes if you're a very casual player you play less than an hour a day just make a new character obviously you're just playing to have fun so make a new character and, and have fun with that if these tips help y'all please drop a like on the video please subscribe for more i'm out